Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars diecast review. And today we're going to take a look at Kurt the Next Gen Rusty's Racing Center trainee number 012 from Cars 3. Now, before we get right into the review and unboxing, let me discuss something. So, Kurt is a next gen piston cup racer who who is one of the trainees at the Rusty's Racing Center and bears the number 012 during his diecast releases he was released as a regular single in 2020 and and again with bug teeth and the bug of uh, and the bug teeth version over there what has been released this year here here the second time as a single so on the packaging we got his artwork and his bug teeth and the old car the classic cars logo and the the red background and the metal logo and it says Kurt with bug teeth and Kurt con los dientes in Spanish language titles the Mattel logo and on the back we've got the Cars 3 logo oh, we have Rusty's Cruz Ramirez Rusty's Wizard Center Lightning McQueen Liability APB and Kurt with bug teeth himself the 2021 Mattel, the Mattel logo, and the Arsene logo. So, I've got, I've, per I've got Kurt with the bug teeth over there, along, along with two, two uh, and Walmart, with other, with two more cases, here we have Liability and Holiday Hotshot Lightning McQueen, and in the mail this week, I the Easter Buggy. And now, without any further ado, let's let's get right into the unboxing. So here we've got uh, here he is all unboxed, and during his appearance in Cars Three, he was one of the trainees trained by Cruiser Mirrors on the treadmills and to go faster, and Kurt was telling Ron. Old, another next gen trainee who I unfortunately don't have that he was a cloud and then Ronald told Kurt to uh, shut it and then the next moment Cruz informed Kurt that the bug spray was coming and sprayed the bug spray on in front of Kurt and he stated that he kept his eyes open <laughs> although I must admit it's I think it was a bit funny there what do you guys think was it very funny leave your thoughts in the comments down below so anyhow you know, he, he was briefly met he was also he was also seen when Lightning McQueen was trying to go faster or to the, as the next gen in racers 
but the his tr the treadmill that he was on was conserved by Cruz when 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 he was going slower than the other treadmills that Kurt and the others were on to conserve energy, and then then Kurt and the others laughed at Lightning, and Lightning and said that he was not taking a nap. And later on in the film, Kurt was briefly mentioned by Sterling when he ordered Cruz to return to the training center to prepare the next trainee to replace Lightning as the new Rusty's racing or er, number 95 in the Piston Cup. But Sterling didn't want Kurt to be the next Rusty's racer. Er, and, s and nicknamed him the Bug Guy, so he so he decided to have Ronald instead. And now, without any further ado, let's get right into the review. <clears throat> Here we've got his happy facial expression with the the bugs on him and his teeth and front end and the headlights and the grill and and the purple on the underneath and on the hood no tampos just the bugs and on the left side we've got the purple rims on the next gen light year racing tires and the number rusty and the number zero twelve in white with the red background and the purple lining at the bottom and the the exhaust pipes and the purple gas caps and the primer gray all over exterior all over and the purple on the spoiler and on the back we've got the tail lights and the white number zero twelve on within the red background on the back bumper. And on the right side, similar design, but completely different. And now let's. Oh, I forgot to. I forgot the undercarriage. I'm so sorry. I sometimes keep forgetting or losing my mind or whatever. Sometimes, it, on the undercarriage, it says Disney Pixar made in Thailand. And and we've got. We have also have F N V eighty eight and P fifty two A. And now let's pull up some of the other next gen racers that share his body mold. We've got Danny Suarez, Richie Gunzit. Herb Kerbler, Eric Breaker, Michael Rodor, Cam Spinner, Barry DePedal, Paul Conrad, Steve Slick LePage, and Conrad Camber, and some of the other Rusty's Racing Center team members we've got. Rusty's Racing Center Lightning McQueen, Regular Cars 3 Lightning McQueen, Cruz Ramirez, Sterling, Rusty and Dusty, the Rusty's brothers, and the Cars 3 Mac hauler, and that is it. So, what do you guys think? Which next gen racer with the Kurt body mold is your favorite? Which Rusty's Racing Center team member is your favorite? And which single package single should I review next? Should it be liability? Holiday Hotshot Lightning McQueen, although I'm not sure if I should open it up in December. Or 
the Easter buggy. Leave your thoughts as well as suggestions in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, oh, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Please also consider the support by checking out my other videos on my channel for public watch time. I would really appreciate it very much. And also consider the support by subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that tonight at 7.30 p.m. is the Blue Emu Maximum Relief 500 at Martinsville Speedway on Fox Spectrum Channel 8, if you have Spectrum. And anyhow... Goodbye now.